my fellow comic book collectors. It's Alan, the Comic Collector Geek, and this is going to be a very small unboxing, but a very cool unboxing. Um, lately, I've been collecting a particular artist, and uh, that artist is Bill Ward. Um, if you actually look right over my shoulder here, uh, you'll see like a, a character called Torchy, and uh, the one, the red one was actually a Bill Ward cover. And Bill Ward was kind of known for doing good girl art. He did a lot of romance books, um, and he did a lot of these kind of humor books, uh, good girl art books. So um, I I really enjoy his art. Uh, what he did, though, that was interesting was later on he did a lot of adult, uh, adult comics uh, where he would do basically... Um, inside these humor books or um, adult magazines, uh, he would basically create like a short, like a, just, well, not even a strip. It would just be one panel and with, a, you know, some joke. Um, and that's what this is. This is a collection of Bill Ward, um, like co comics that were cartoon, like humor related car comics. And so we got this box. This box. <laughs> I can't worry. I'm showing my address here. Um, and um, it has like, I think it's like 12. I think I have, I bought 12 books and I got them for a great price. Normally, um, these humor books actually sell for quite a bit of money. If you ever want to, if you ever, you know, uh, want to find something that's a little bit under the radar and where you can, you know, it's a good investment. Uh, Bill Ward humor books are are often, if the people don't know what they are, <laughs> they can sell for really cheap, like 10 bucks. That's that's a cheap price. Um, but normally they can sell anywhere from 50 to a hundred dollars. So, you know, it's one of those things if you if you find the right person <laughs> that doesn't know what they have, uh, that they don't realize that they're Bill Ward art inside, uh, you can actually get some pretty good deals on these things. Now, the guy that I bought these from actually did know that they were Bill Ward uh, stuff, but he didn't really have high prices on them. He was selling them, it was like $10 each, and I thought, oh, that's a really good price. And um, I basically bundled a whole bunch together, so I got a good price on it. And um, I'll show you the books. And I might even show you some interior stuff as well, because um, I'll show you what I mean by these kind of sexy ones so you'll see like um they were kind of like so this is the one popular jokes and you'll see it's kind of a mixture of like some pinups this is like a pinup like actual person and then you'll see some bill ward art so this is bill ward right here now there'll be other artists that are mixed in because it's like humor uh they'll all do their little panels and um but bill ward he's kind of known for this very um uh, voluptuous kind of women and uh, with very like uh, very everything looks very pointy and sharp <laughs> I don't know with uh, Bill Ward's art um, also he did very detailed line work like if you compare Bill Ward's work which is right here to some of the art other artists around him um, you'll notice that it's much more detailed and uh, it's you know you can see that you know the level of professionalism uh, with Bill Ward's art so just a, a really great artist. So this is um, Popular Jokes. Now these would have come out between the late 50s to 70s they kind of ran for. Um, and then here's some more Popular Jokes. So actually this is Popular Cartoons. And again, this is another Bill Ward. The, the ones that you want to buy, I mean, not all of them have Bill Ward covers, but um, uh, you know they'll have interiors that are Bill Ward. You look for the ones with the Bill Ward covers. They go for a little bit more than the ones with just the only the interiors that Bill Ward did. Uh, so this is just another one. As I said, he did all these kind of uh, sexy kind of uh, good girl art uh, panels. Uh, and, uh, you know, with a little bit of humor. Uh, this one is, for gosh cakes, I'm giving her a raise in salary causes her to jump for joy. Let's give her another one. <laughs> you know, just kind of fun, you know, sexy humor. So that's popular cartoons. So these are some of the titles you would look for. So popular jokes, popular cartoons. And then another one, um, 
is Cartoon Parade. Now, the publisher for all these books was um, uh, Humorama. And Humorama basically made these sort of pinup style joke related books. And um, this one, for example, you'll notice there's no um, Ward on the cover. None of, this, none of this artwork is Bill Ward. So let me just open it up. Now, some of these might have risque stuff inside, so I, I can't necessarily show it, but um, I'll show you what I can. <laughs> and, um, you know, it's it's pretty cool stuff. One sec, here, let's, let me get into it here. Okay, so the back. <laughs> like, you, I, I, I can't even show it. See, it's like a pinup on the back, but it's a nude pinup. Um, so let me just quickly show you what I mean. One sec here. So, I, you know, I have to find pages that I can actually show because a lot of it was a mixture of pinups, like in this case, nude pinups, um, with um, Bill Ward art inside. I gotta, I gotta, another artist that you'll see, and I, I'm not sure if I can show it because it's a little challenging, is Wenzel. Wen, Wenzel. This is Wenzel art, another good, good girl artist. Um, there's a bunch that were kind of the, the, the pinnacle of, um, these cartoon good girl artists. Um, I'm just trying to find some Bill Ward art. The problem was there was one, but it was like, uh, mixture, <laughs> it was mixed in with some, um, adulty stuff. So let me see, this is, this is one here. I'm just trying to figure out how to show it. One sec here. Just show it kind of. So that there's some Bill, I believe that's Bill Ward there. This one doesn't usually you'll say Ward on it, but I don't know. That looks like his style. Uh, there's a few people that mimicked Bill Ward's style as well, so I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, so these these books were kind of. Oh, here's a here's a good example. Here's that here. That's a good example of Bill Ward's art. So yeah, they would always have some little joke at the bottom. So uh, let's go, baby. It's time to stretch our legs. <laughs> so yeah, so just, you know, fun, fun, fun um, humor related uh, cartoons. Sort of sexy and fun. One sec here, I'm gonna put it back. It's one of my pet peeves, leaving books out of their bags. <laughs> I just I get all paranoid. Um, Okay, so that's next one. Now, this was the one that really inspired the whole order altogether. Um, this is Cartoon Fun and Comedy, and it just has a great Bill Ward cover. So when whenever you can find um, one of these humor books where the, the full front is uh, a Bill Ward, they go for a premium. I mean, these are a little bit rarer, and um, just, you know, Bill Ward collectors will always go for this. Usually... Um, my method to find these kind of books is um, I try to figure out which titles had Bill Ward art in them, and then I just search for those titles. So, for example, this is Cartoon, Fun, and Comedy. Um, another thing that I've done uh, in order to find out what the titles were, um, Bill Ward did a lot of stuff for Humorama, and that was the publisher. And um, basically, I just searched on my comic shop for all the Bill, uh, not, uh, all the Humorama titles so and then I would go to eBay and try to find them cheaply uh, so yeah this is a good example of Bill Ward art very very cool stuff and then we got another popular jokes again this one you know doesn't have any Bill Ward on the cover which is kind of disappointing but uh, but still you know uh, there would be Bill Ward inside uh, and that's that's really the reason I picked it up uh, this is another one with some Bill Ward on the cover. And you can see how, how his artwork really stands out compared to the others in the in the adult humor uh, joke uh, industry. Like, it's just, like, so much more detail, so much more sophisticated art. Uh, and it's just, you know, he was a golden age artist, and they really perfected their skills. Um, and this is, like, a book that came out probably in the late 60s. So, you know, he was just, you know, way above everyone else. It's <laughs> just, just different level, uh, but great stuff. 
Okay, that's the first stack. And then we've got one more stack here. Okay, so this one, this one has a bit of a nude cover, so I gotta <laughs> a little, a little bit censor it. This is the the joke, a Joker is another title, and this one has Bill Ward right there. So that's Bill Ward art. I'm not even sure if I'm censoring it properly. Oh, probably not. Um, <laughs> but you have some Bill Ward on the cover, and Joker had um it was a fairly long running series uh, that had a lot of Bill Ward, so it's a really great one. And then we got po more popular jokes. And you can see this one is, you can see how it's got the mixture of uh, the, the humor and the adult uh, pinups. And then we got uh, more popular jokes. And this one has some Bill Ward. And this is, this is Bill Ward here, I believe. Um, there's another artist, uh, one sec here, let's see if I can find it. Like some of this looks like Win Winzel and stuff like that. So, um, there's a few artists that, uh, are kind of the standout artists of the era. And here's another one, Popular Jokes. You got, um, a Ward here. This is Ward. Um, not a great Ward one. This one's kind of, looks like a bit of a rush sketch, but... And then you got Wenzel. I'm not sure who the artists at the top are, but those are the two standout ones, Wenzel and uh, Ward. Now people also will collect Wenzel art. He, he did a lot of really great covers and uh, panels, I should say. And then we got some more. This is Poplar Cartoons. You can see this is like probably in the 70s. Uh, and uh, it has a little bit of ward down the corner right there. So the, the one that I showed where it was like the full cover, that's the that was the big one for this collection. And then this is the last one of the lot. And it has like some ward right there. That's Bill Ward in the corner there. And this is Poplar Cartoons. Again, this would probably be late 60s, early 70s. So those are the those are the books. It was a pretty big haul of, um, of these kind of adult cartoons uh, from Bill Ward. And that's what I like to do. I like to collect particular artists and try to get as many examples of their work as I can. And I really like Bill Ward. I think he um, he kind of won me over with Torchy. <laughs> I've been collecting him ever since. So um, definitely a great artist. Uh, one to check out and learn more about. So um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and um, comment below what which artists, maybe good girl artists that you like. And um, yeah, thanks again for watching. Bye for now.